Hey everybody, it's Kent Jackson from Uniques and Antiques, and after a short break, we are back with an online-only mid-century modern design auction. The sale will happen on May 19th, 2020, and it's online only, which means there's not going to be anybody in the building for preview, nobody in the building for uh, uh, bidding live. We do accept phone bids and absentee bids, uh, so you need to email us and uh, we'll get you set up for that. Phone bids must start at at least 300 or we can't call you on the phone. If you want to leave, a, if you want to be less than that, leave an absentee bid. So 640 lots approximately in this auction starting at 11 a.m. on Tuesday, May 19th. And as usual, I'm going to do a quick video, walk up and down the aisles. You can see what's here. The video might be a little bit more valuable than usual because you'll be able to get to see different angles of the items that you would have been able to see if you could come in person, but you can't because we're uh, online only for this portion of our of our business. So let's start out in the, here in the beginning. So lot number one, very nice group of uh, chess sets right there, Aldo Tora, Atmos Clocks, leather, um, <coughs> leather Pig, here's a very cool Picasso statue. You have other great glassware. A lot of these items are all pictured on our website. They're on live auctioneers and invaluable for online bidding. One of my favorite items, and I did a uh, time lapse of me trying to take this thing apart and put it back together, is this amazing um, puzzle thing right here that it, it, once you figure out how to get it started, <laughs> which I'm having trouble with right now, you then... How do you start this? I don't remember. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna have to come back to it. The top, I can't lift it off, but it comes up. Oh, there we go. There's the first part, right? So that comes off and then the top comes off and then the side and it ends up with a whole bunch of boxes inside. Very interesting piece of art right there. Let me skew along here. Very nice Laverne table. As you can see, it's all etched like it's supposed to be, the Chan design. It's signed Philip and Kelvin Laverne right here. It does have one slight little imperfection on the edge of the rim. I'm trying to find it. I can show it to you. It's really not that big of a deal, but it is there, so I don't wanna, I don't wanna um, underplay it. So here it is right here. The edge has a little break in it right there. Not too bad coming around the front right there. Very nice patina on top. You see it has like the orange and the green in it. Still the orange on that part right there. Really not too much to um, to complain about except for that one little spot. There's some great tables underneath. Lucite, look at the size and the thickness of this Lucite table. Another good reason to watch the video is that you can see sizes of these items in relation to other items. These are amazing by Terrence Main. I'm going to walk around these items right here, lot 40 and 41. These are all carved stone, and uh, they are amazing. But you can see all the way around. And here's number 41, all the way around, not too, I mean, it has its uh, issues with a little bit of, like it's got a, like a, I don't know, maybe a spill right here. That could probably be power washed out or scrubbed out. Very nice. Here's another Terrence Main, lot 42. This is all bronze. Very amazing Terrence Main. Nothing to complain about there. And we also have the Terrence Main catalog. This is actually in the catalog, the uh, the bench. It's in the artist directory. George Jensen rolling pins. These were very cool. There's a pair of those. One's a little bit lighter wood. Here's an amazing... Tambor door sec or the credenza. And you can see the tambor door works very nicely. <coughs> so I plan on going through and doing some better inspections of these items so you can see them, so you can bid on them. So this is going to be a little bit longer video than usual. Uh, watch it at double speed if you think I'm going too slow. That's something I'd like to do, especially during the how to videos. You go to that little gear in the bottom right corner of your YouTube player and you can select faster speed. And I always put on like at least one and a half times, sometimes two times if the guy is a little bit long, long winded. I'm like, oh, get to the point. We have no time. 
very nice bronze guy right there. You got the Paul Macabre. You have the amazing pair of chairs. Lots of interest in these red chairs with the swivel bases. Got my mask on, it's a little bit suffocating. Speaking of that, for pickup during this auction, it's contactless. We set an appointment. Uh, we'll put the items out in one of our units and you pick it up unattended. So it's, uh, it's gonna be pickup by appointment only, but we'll have three stations for pickup, probably in 20 minute increments, inter intervals, that will do that. And th those areas will be sanitized after every pickup and uh, there's only a skeleton crew here, just Tim and I and my daughter Gabby. All right, beautiful groups of mid-century furniture. Look at this back here, a very nice Miami modern piece right there. I can't dig that all out, but it's got the um, it's got the good rattan, the split rattan. There's a pair of these guys, pretty nice lot. One ninety one. We come around the corner here. This is Aldo Tura style. Look at that nice chest right there around the corner this way the aisles are a little bit skinnier than normal because you know what nobody's coming through there's no preview except for what we're seeing right now look at this nice little tall chest right here with the uh the bottom base right there this is the brasilia with the rare Broyhill premier veneer comes from ancient egypt Brasilia. All right, moving around the corner. Churner chair. Nice Italian ladder backs. This is a nice little uh, Muller table right there. Take a look at the catalog. We're happy to answer all of your questions via email, via phone call. If there's items you want to see better condition on, we can go in and take closer looks at the uh, at the finish on the arms for this chair, the Kofad Larson for four seventy lot four seventy five. Ah, let me walk down here. Ah, oh, there's that chandelier we were looking for, lot number four eighty two. Very nice little spiral chandelier. Pace. Dunbar style right there, not signed, but very much like Dunbar. It probably is signed under the black paint. Nice pair of those Eames aluminum chairs coming this direction here. Now we also have another auction on May 21st, about 350 lots of decorative arts and jewelry and, and uh, garden items. It's a garden sale. So check that out if you uh, after you finish checking out the sale on Tuesday th the 19th. Coming down here, you got great bedroom furniture. We are going to do our New York City delivery, curbside delivery, contactless, where we put it on the curb, you pick it up off the curb, and we're on our way again. I don't want to uh, have too many people coming down this way, so we'll just come your way and drop it off. We are going to do curbside delivery in the local area as well. So picture, you know, for a bedroom set or a dining room set, uh, it's going to be more expensive. But if it's a lamp, maybe $20. If it's a lamp and two end tables, $20. We'll bring it right to your location. Uh, after the auction is one, we'll come up with the prices for these right here. These are, little, these are going to be in all of our pickup stations right there. You're going to have some, some disinfecting spray and a hand sanitizer at our pickup stations. So uh, we're prepared for that. We're going to you know, just sanitize a lot, keep people out of here, keep our contact with other people down, and I think we'll be okay. Here's a nice uh, Chesterfield sofa. Let me come around here to the beginning again, and we'll do the lobby. There's some good stuff in the lobby. I haven't been talking much about the items. They're self-explanatory. <laughs> Look at that nice chandelier. This is Wilkinson. This is something that shows up better on video than you might expect other places. So it's light, it's lighted up 
It's signed Wilkinson. It's lot number 255. It comes with the pedestal. I think it turns even. Yeah, look at that. It even uh, rotates with the uh, kind of like a, a Lazy Susan type thing. Looks just as good from the back as it does from the front. They paid almost, we had the receipt, they paid almost $20,000 for this. Selling at the auction should bring three, four, five thousand. That's signed tan up top there, T A or T Tar T A R R. Here's a nice corner cabinet. Here's a very nice R way set. It's a low chest and high chest. It's quality furniture. This is the good, you know, American modern that they talk about. Some good art here on the ground. There's an Alexander Calder lithograph. This is by Stickley, but it's in day two. That's May 21st. That's in our decorative arts auction. But it's out here because that's where it would fit. A good uh, Bruton Pace mirror right there. A very nice one. This is also nice. But we have the nicest mirror we have coming up. It's a Carl Springer one. I'll show you that one in a little bit. Nice mirror. There's art on the walls. Check it, that stuff out in the catalog. Look at this great goatskin table with two large leaves. Very nice. It does have these little like pock marks in it. Let's see if I can get the light on it. Right, see that? Not really objectionable so much, but you can kind of see where I don't know that it it's like they put the skin over top of like <laughs> screw heads and the screw heads are, are visible now. It's not like they're being screwed in from the other side though. Uh, there's the Bruno style chairs, BRNO style chairs. A couple uh, cabinets in the back by Noel with the white tops. Nice little, probably Bomb Ritter chair. Signed Bomb Ritter. Look at that. Home goods. Here's a nice set of like Saarinen style tulip chairs. Has all the cushions. There they are. You're welcome. Look at this great little chair right here. The fiberglass one. Very nice. Got the gazelle table. Nice little thick piece of glass on top. Lot 397. Let me jump out front. Here's These are carpets that are going to be in the second day on the 21st. But in the lobby, some of the best items in the auction. An amazing Bruton uh, stainless steel glass console table, lot 336. Here's a great pair of chairs. Lot 335. Lot 334 is signed Vladimir Kagan. It's got a table like that and two boards right here. Two large, like two foot boards. We put, we pictured it all put together. Super nice. Lot 333. Amazing chair right here. But watch this. Look at the cane in the back. Beautiful. Now it does have a tiny little miss right here. That's why you watch the video, see all this stuff. But the upholstery is beautiful. You could you could live with that. That's not a big deal. Here's look at this great credenza down here. Beautiful. This is the one that's um, Peter Witt style. It's got the re, re uh, reversible doors. They could be they're black on the other side, so you can make them black doors. And that same one has you can see the uh, the drawers right here. Stack of like three or four or five drawers. <sighs> planters now we do have a garden items in both auctions the Tuesday auction and the Thursday auction we'll do a, th a second video for all the planters and and uh, outdoor furniture a pair of these super nice deco cabinets lacquer number 325 they're brevetello Italian very nice look at the look at the workmanship on those here's a pair of uh, garden pieces. These are in the second day. These are in the 21st auction. This is also in the 21st. So a lot of the stuff in the lobby here is all for the 21st. Meanwhile, this very nice uh, travertine table. See part two of the video by going to our YouTube profile. And so is this, lot 295. Look at this.